don't know I wanna know you better The way that you talk to me The way that you make me feel I don't know if you're real I wanna put you in that spotlight Looking at you all night Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be a fun and exciting video. It is going to be a nice and delicious crock pot meal. And then I am going to show you guys how I decorate for fall. So if you like content like this, just keep watching. Okay, you guys, I found this recipe on Pinterest. It is called the Mississippi Pot Roast. So the recipe calls for chuck roast, but all they had at the store was chuck steak. So I think this, well, this is the second time we've made this and the second time wasn't as great as the first time, but I really think it had to do with me not adding the butter on top. So, or it could have been the type of steak that, or the chuck roast, but chuck steak that we got. I think it's just a little bit maybe leaner. But all you need is ranch seasoning packet, a jus gravy sauce packet, um, some beef broth, the obviously the chuck roast or chuck steak, and pepperoncinis, and also some butter. Don't forget the butter! Then you can do it on high for about four to six hours or on low for six to eight. Kind of depends on what you like. I always like to do low and slow. I feel like it just makes it cook better. So it's really just a preference. Okay, so here is where I had to take it out and cut it into small pieces where the first one that I did it just shredded and I put it on the Hawaiian rolls and they were delicious. Not to say that, that this wasn't delicious, the flavor was all there. It just was a tougher cut of meat. So I had to just cut it into little pieces and again, put it on the Hawaiian rolls and then I put some pepperoncinis on there and ah, uh, chef's kiss, delicious. Sing until my lungs give out your beautiful So when I do a crock pot meal, I usually try to use paper plates. I know, so fancy. And I do that because if I'm doing a crock pot meal, you guys, then I obviously want less dishes. So paper plates it is, and this was a very classy dinner. Just kidding. It was <laughs> it was just on paper plates. It was yummy. We ate it up. I wanna put you in that spotlight. Looking at you all night. Put you in that spotlight. You make me feel fine. Wanna look at you all night. Wanna put you in that spotlight. Oh, you know. Till my lungs give out your beautiful
wanna put you in that spotlight Looking at you all night, all night I'll sing until my lungs give out your beautiful like a lot and it actually kind of is i didn't think i had this much fall stuff but here we are so a lot of this stuff is from years and years ago except for like this blessed sign i got last last fall i don't know probably a tj maxx or something oh yeah tj maxx 9.99 um a lot of this other stuff I got from like Dollar Spot at Target. A lot of the stuff I probably took off. Yeah. Oh, five dollars at Big Lots. I know like a lot of these were yeah, like Target Dollar Spot. Um some of this stuff is like stuff I've had for a long time and some pumpkins that I have. This I got, I got last December maybe, or last, oh, it was Thanksgiving. It was from my husband's uncle. He gave that to us. Um, we have lots of pumpkins. I was going for like a neutral theme, so I may not use like the green one, but I have like a lot of white pumpkins. Oops, there that one goes. Um, a lot of burlap, so a lot of the neutral and white tones I think I'm probably gonna use. Um, this is the same one like the white one, but orange, different stem. Um, Dollar Spot, Target, Bath and Body Works candles, some more of the pumpkins. This I've had forever and I can't remember where I got it, but that's cute, I like that. And this has always been <laughs> So sweet, I love this. I think I'm gonna put it like outside. I don't know how it'll hold up outside, but I think last year I put it on the pantry door and it was really cute. So maybe I'll do that. I have this cute little pillow. Um, this, I didn't even take the tag off. So that's probably last year I got. And this huge pumpkin, which I love. And I have a new garland that was from last year. And if you guys saw my Insta stories, then you saw my, I started to do these pieces um, for fall. So this one is gonna go probably right here, like it was, and I'm gonna dress up a little center thing for um, the ottoman. So this is what we're working with, you guys. Oh, let me show you guys what I got that's new. Okay, guys, so I did get a couple things today at the dollar store. Um, so I found this really cute pumpkin pie sign. It's just like a little boxed stand. So you can put this anywhere. Um, I thought it was really cute. So you can hang it on your wall. You could hang it on, you could put it on a, on a table. You can put it pretty much anywhere. I also got this wall art gathered together. I liked the colors of it and I thought it was really um, cute. I could probably even dress it up like with a bow if I wanted to. Um, so those were $1.25 each. Um, sticking with the dollar store. So this is something that I made. So what I did was, uh, backwards. It's this cute garland and it has these like clips. You guys can see that. 
It has these clips on the leaves and I have a couple pumpkins I'm gonna put on it. I haven't decided where I wanna put it yet. I wanted to put it on the fireplace or above the fireplace, but I'm thinking that that's where that garland is gonna go and I'm not sure yet. I don't love all the glitter, but I thought it was really cute and festive. So I made that. And that's from the dollar store. And then I have these little pumpkins. They were originally like a white color. No, I'm sorry, they were orange. And I painted them to be like a, um, like a muted white color. So they just clip right on that. These I got at TJ Maxx. These are hand towels. They're so soft. Came in a pack of two. I want to say it was like $12.99. You guys, I'm a sucker for towels. So Tim knows that these are just decorative towels, not hand towels. <laughs> if you know, you know. This I got from TJ Maxx also. Um, so it just says, hello, fall. I think this was... And Raydon, you guys, if you don't know me, you know, if you don't know me, Raydon is like everything to me. Anytime I see her font, um, I love it. Like I have a whole, um, not bookshelf. I don't even know what it's called. I can't think of the word. I have a whole thing of all of her, the stuff that I have that's in her font and I love it. So this I'm thinking I'm gonna put in the front way, entryway. I found at Target at the dollar spot area the bullseye spot for $3 and there's a good amount in there. Cute, cute little stems on them. Could be cute as fillers. Oh, this I got the dollar store too. Really cute. These I'm in love with. So these I'm in love with. So I found these um, at TJ Maxx today and they're each $7.99. And I feel like I have, I think I have a really cute vase. I can put these in for filler or a bowl. I'm not sure you guys, I don't know. Um, sometimes I just get things and then I find a spot for them. So I got the creamy white one and then the orange one, which I thought were really cute. I got those. And this, you guys, I actually made. Um, it's just going to be like a, a tassel. That's coming off. I have a tray on my coffee bar and I think I made this and I'm thinking I'm gonna just add that to that. It's got a cute little pumpkin on the end. And then last but not least, I got this at TJ Maxx. I think it was TJ Maxx too. Um, it was $12.99. It's a pretty good, like sturdy, heavy, cute piece. I'm in for all the neutrals and like burnt oranges. I thought I gave you guys a haul of what I have and what I bought this year. Let's get into the fun part, which is decorating. So baby, let me hold you, hold you. I want to show you, show you, show you how to, how to treat you right, treat you right. Pull you closer to the highs and lows. Yeah, I want to show you how to treat you right, treat you right. Let me show you what love is and why it's beautiful. Just put your body on top of mine, yeah I'm gonna treat you the same way As all the girls who have no shame No, I die for you They've been cruel to you Saying things they don't mean They've been rude to you Disrespect how you feel But baby, I never Go that far Cause I know better than that So baby You go. 
Yeah. 